So other than bras as crop tops and neon colors, what else am I predicting? Let's go. You're gonna see it in bikinis, shorts, pants, crop tops, sweaters, dresses. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, get ready for a roller coaster. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Well, not really. <laughs> Almost didn't quit my job, scared of failing at what I love Forgot that under pressure I do everything fucking better Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name's Kerry. Don't forget to subscribe. I post a lot of videos with fashion content, sometimes bikinis, makeup, whatever the F I feel like. Probably believe edit that part out actually. I'm trying to be a little more, how do you say it? Um advertiser friendly <laughs> okay anyway today I wanted to do a fun video that I've been thinking about doing for a while and it is my trend predi predictions for 2022 I'm basically talking about fashion I might add in some beauty I don't know but fashion trend predictions for 2022 I'm actually wearing one of them or maybe two actually because my number one is wearing bras and bikini tops as crop tops First of all, why don't we already do that? I mean, one, it just makes sense. A lot of the times, like, my bikini tops are really cute and would double as a great crop top. They're also more padded and secure than a lot of crop tops. And, like, you're saving money because you're just wearing your bras and bikinis that are the same size as the crop tops at the stores as crop tops. So I kind of already started doing that, So, but I think it's going to definitely continue throughout 2022, and we will see that in many major fashion Um fashion brands, fashion looks, fashion influencers, icons, all of that. So that is my number one thing. Number two, I also think neon is gonna be big this year. I feel like neon has always been big in a way. Like I feel like I've always loved neon, but even though I just recorded a New Year's New Year's Eve video or New Year's Eve fashion influ like inspiration video and did a lot of glitter and stuff, I feel like neon colors is gonna be bigger for 2022 than glitter and metallic vibes. I don't know why, it's just kind of my mood. So that's why I'm wearing this cute lingerie bra. I don't know why I said lingerie bra because it's just a regular bra but lacy. But I don't wear bras a lot, so that's why I feel like whenever I'm wearing one, I'm always like, oh, lingerie mood. Um, but I feel like, see, like wearing this outfit out is a 2022 style prediction. Hold on. This um, bra that I'm wearing actually came from a set on my wish list that I received, I think yesterday or the day before. I love this vibe. It's nice and bright and neon-y. Actually, this would have been perfect for my Grinch style video that I already did a few weeks ago, but it is also just good inspo for 2022 in general. Just bright neons, fun, doing whatever the fuck you want. Sorry, I gotta stop swearing so much. Basically, just enjoying life and letting your fashion reflect that rather than trying to like dress any way specifically for somebody else's benefit or enjoyment. There you go. You heard it here first. Okay, so other than bras as crop tops and neon colors, what else am I predicting? Let's go. I'm also predicting a lot more um, sweatshirt and sweater dresses. Right now I'm wearing a sweater dress that I got recently. I think it's really cute and comfy and cozy. Um, I've gotten a bunch of sweater dresses from brands I've worked with recently. This one is more kind of a casual vibe with a hood. It has like the zip, which I like. I'm wearing more of a sweater vibe, but it's still just as cozy as a sweatshirt. This is a really cute one that's cinched at the waist. So is this one. And I really like that. I think that we're going to see a lot of cinched at the waist sweater dresses and sweatshirt dresses in 2022 because the cinch part makes it a little bit sexy and shape like shape your body, but you're still really comfortable. You're dressed appropriate to either take a nap or go to lunch or dinner. Um, you're comfortable, you're warm, and you look really cool and stylish in my opinion. So these are all things I think are gonna come into play with 2022. A lot of like comfy and cute, but also sexy at the same time fashion. Like that's my vibe 100%. And I think that's, we're gonna see a continuing, a continuous shift towards that direction with most brands and most influencers. Um, I love this. I'm so cozy right now. I'm always cold, even though I live in Florida. So this is great news for me. Okay, next trend, let's go. So another 2022 fashion trend I'm most definitely seeing this year, long coats everywhere. Wearing them out over an outfit to run to the store, wearing them simply as a dress on their own. It is a vibe and it is 
just so cool. I love it. I love long coats these days. I'm predicting a lot of animal print, not just for jackets, but also for like long coats, but also just in clothing in general. Um, cheetah print obviously has been fashionable, but I'm predicting like zebra print really coming back in style. Seeing a lot of cheetah print and leopard print stuff everywhere. You heard it here uh, first. You heard it here first, folks. Okay, another 2022 trend I'm predicting is not just the long coats, but yes, we're still on that, but like clashing of prints and different like fashion elements. For example, this is plaid and fur, which actually probably goes together pretty well typically, but with also including like a neon underneath it, all of it together seems like it might clash, but I feel like it looks so dope and effortless. Um, again, we love the long coat vibe and just in general, everything about this outfit. Also, you probably wouldn't typically think to pair like a long coat like the one I'm wearing with like white short, like active shorts and a bra, but it works so well. So another trend prediction I have for this year is purple is going to be everywhere. So get on board. You're going to see it in bikinis, shorts, pants, crop tops, sweaters, dresses. I also think that purple and more specifically lavender is going to be a color a mood like a very trending color for valentine's day this year so keep your eyes on that i have some more um lilac style things i want to show you guys but yeah my prediction is purple is going to be everywhere so get ready i also want to mention another prediction i have for 2022 i think it kind of has already started in 2021 but i think it's just going to continue to grow into 2022 and probably more years going forward it's platform shoes like this instead of heels they still look hot they're really cool they're comfortable and you're not gonna trip every second so you heard it here like oh sorry these leggings just came out of my dryer which i don't know if they should even go in there but welcome to my life anyway i wanted to say so i just wanted to mention like i was saying before i definitely think 2022 we're gonna see a lot of animal print um but Again, like I was saying with the purple, I think purple is going to be a huge color for 2022 and animal prints like this with like the dark purple and like the light purple combination, it's kind of muted purple. So it's almost, it's not too crazy of the actual animal print. Like you would see that would be like very like, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Like it's kind of like, it's, it's not exact, like it's definitely not like super realistic but it's not too far-fetched I guess what is what I'm trying to say with like the muted purple colors for this animal print leopard print leggings but I also think this color of animal not just animal print but purple in general more of a lilac is going to be a huge 2022 color and a huge valentine's day color this year I think for valentine's day we're going to see a step away from pink and red and a trend of like more purple style things which I love I think that's a vibe and a mood and I'm here for it but especially for Valentine's Day, I'm thinking like the lighter purples, like a lilacs, um, lavenders, all of that. Love it. So we are definitely going to see a trend of soft muted purples and like pastel greens together. Something like this. I'm not going to try this on. Well, I might try the bottoms on over these shorts just because, like I said, this is a very pg professional channel now so we're not doing anything crazy but i did want to show you this lingerie outfit i had received recently i think it's so cute and i definitely think these style of colors together is a 2020 2022 like mood inspiration vibe not just for lingerie or see-through things even though this is kind of both but also just in general and i like this style a lot of like the crop top shirt um I think we're going to see that a lot in 2022 and these colors are great for what I think is going to be trending for 2022 color wise and yeah this is another example I think of colors in just like an uh, um, aesthetic we're going to see for 2022 kind of like purple pinks more purple than pink I think but I still love pink you know that welcome to my pink Christmas vibes always um, but I love purple and I feel like the combination of the purple colors in here, the light purple, dark purple, this is a 2022 mood. But this dress I'm actually going to throw on real quick to show you guys. I'm going to, I don't want to show it too much actually, so I'm going to maybe just show it to you. But like, this is another Valentine's Day inspiration mood. I'm going to use, I'm going to try this on for my Valentine's video. I'll be posting 
in a few weeks. But this color went the lilac or lavender, light purple, and then the dark purple animal prints. It is 2022 in spa. Okay, so I think we're going to see a, a big increase in monotone, monotone or one color outfits that are still very like flashy in their own way. Like for example, this is an all white outfit, but it has the festival crop top with the flowers. There's some mesh in there. These are like very tight workout shorts. I mean, I don't work out in them because I don't work out, but you could. That's what they're meant for, I think. Um, so stuff like this, like sim sort of simple and understated until you like take a d deeper look into it. We're gonna see a lot of in 2022, for sure. Okay, and my last thing I wanna mention for Actually, two things I want to mention last for my 2022 predictions. We're going to see a lot of crochet everywhere. I'm going to insert clips of me wearing some of my crochet bikinis I recently got from Shein. This is a crochet cover-up. I kind of like this crochet bikini, but I just kind of wish it could tie on both sides over here because I feel like it's like uneven and weird, but it's still really cute, right? Um, Just for an example, over any bikini would look cute. Crochet is going to be a huge 2022 trend, and I'm so here for it. I love crochet bikinis. I love crochet in general. So we're going to fucking rock that, and it's going to be dope. Um, and the last thing I want to mention is obviously fishnet tights. I don't want to put them on right now because with my nails, hopefully I'm going to get these nails off today. If I feel like soaking my nails for a little bit, it's a pain in the ass, but I'm going to insert a clip of me wearing my fishnets. One, this is probably what I'm actually going to wear for freaking New Year's because I'm not going to do anything crazy. I'm probably going to be chilling at home. But I love fishnets, especially pink ones. My new oversized Barbie shirt. Um, I have recently gotten like a million different fishnets from Amazon and even like Shein, I think. So I have a, almost every color fishnet. I had bright lime green for the Grinch look and that was a vibe. In general, fishnets are going to be huge in 2022. So get ready. Um, maybe I'll do a 2022 makeup predictions video if you guys are interested. Let me know what you think. Let me know what you thought about this video. What prediction are you most excited for? Which one do you agree with the most? And which one do you think is definitely not true? Let me know in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe. Love y'all. See you next time.